guess what? It's okay to be alone right now. There's been a lot of talk online lately about women wanting provider men. Women wanting the man to pay more than just half between 30 and 100%. And she's still gonna work and she's still gonna collect money and her money will go towards the household, right? Do you embody, the question I have is, do you embody the characteristics, the mindset, the appeal, the look that a man would want? The type of man that would pay for everything. The question is, do you embody the characteristics, the mindset, the appeal, the look that a man would want, the type of man that's willing to pay for everything, do you even encompass all of those things? Because I would imagine there's a certain type of guy who has a provider mindset and the type of woman that he would want is probably not just your average lady. I remember speaking to my pastor my um, old pastor and he's a provider you know his wife works part-time sometimes you know when she wants to I don't think she is right now but I asked him I said what was it about your wife that made you want to just take care of her and he said she's my best friend and she's loyal and she was somebody I knew that I, I knew I could trust Okay. That's all right. I think it's important for us to ask questions. The type of person that you're looking for, you might want to reach out to those men in your circle and ask questions. And this, I, I, I definitely agree with Kendra G on this. You have to have conversations with men that are that way and see what it is that they're looking for. And if that's what you really want, you're going to have to make some changes in your life and actually become that if that's what you're looking for. I agree with that. 